uh, some disturbing new details about a shooting that happened on I-95. It left one victim in critical condition. Authorities now saying the shooter had sideswiped that victim's car before suddenly opening fire. And theirs wasn't the only car targeted. Local 10's Rosh Lowe is live with the latest on the search for this dangerous driver. And this is becoming a very concerning trend in South Florida. We have covered a number of cases of road rage on I-95 where shots are fired. Once again, we have a situation just last night in Fort Lauderdale. And the message from the Broward Sheriff's Office is if someone's yelling at you and you're driving down the road, don't engage. Sunday night, 8.30 p.m., I-95 south of Sunrise Boulevard. We have a shooting and two victims in a Nissan Sentra. The female victim has critical life-threatening injuries. According to investigators, a white BMW was speeding down 95 and sideswiped the Nissan Sentra. The passenger of the Nissan Sentra unrolled his window and they believe he was trying to get the BMW, the driver of the BMW, to slow down. The driver did not slow down and there was a verbal argument and then the shooting. There is also a third victim, a female juvenile, who was in another car and was also hit. If you were driving on 95 southbound between 8 o'clock and 9 o'clock last night on Sunday night, perhaps, you know, a lot of people have GoPros, they have cameras on their front windshields. Maybe they saw something and they just thought, you know, you see stuff like that all the time sometimes on 95. Unfortunately, this turned uh, uh, violent. We have seen an alarming increase in the road rage shootings on 95. We have been on the scene of multiple cases in recent months. Many of these cases remain unsolved. What we're telling people is that if you find yourself in this situation, do not engage. 